The main mission of the Pulmonary Genetic Center at Brigham Women's Hospital and at Boston Children's Hospital is to provide centralized care and expertise for patients with genetic forms of lung disease. We see patients who either have a known diagnosis of a rare lung disease of genetic basis or patients who are suspected to have uh, such a diagnosis. Patients who come to the center are seen both by a pulmonologist who has expertise in genetics and also by a certified genetic counselor. So my role in the Pulmonary Genetics Center is to meet with patients uh, when they first come in to help make a decision about whether or not to pursue genetic testing in conjunction with our physicians, to explain the ins and outs of genetic testing so that they can make an informed decision about whether or not to move forward, and then after we receive results back, I meet with patients to help them understand the implications for both themselves and their family members, and also to help them process some of the emotions that can come along with getting a genetic diagnosis. When I first came to Children's, I had um, a really bad case of pneumonia, and for a really long time I had a bunch of symptoms, and I knew I had an immune disease, but never really knew the genetic cause but by doing genetic research, I was able to find out what exactly the cause of my disease is, and now I'm on a new treatment plan that's improved my life significantly. It's really um, an intense experience to receive a diagnosis, but I've had some really incredible physicians along the way. The doctors here at Brigham and Women's Hospital have been um, fantastic. It's been very personalized. They, um, really come down to a personal level with every patient, especially that's my experience. We also are very much focused on uh, accelerating research to advance the use of genetics in clinical practice, to understand the genetic underpinnings of disease, to discover new genes related to uh, lung disease, and uh, to accelerate the development of new therapeutics. BHD stands for Bert Hogg Dubay, uh, and it's a, a monogenic uh, uh, autosomal dominant cystic lung disease. Um, so it's, it's due to mutations in one gene. Uh, we know of about 600 families in the world that have this mutation, uh, and I personally take care of 21 patients uh, with this disorder. The Pulmonary Genetics Center has allowed us to uh, accumulate multiple patients with these very rare genetic lung diseases uh, and to study similarities and differences uh, between these patients and these families and ultimately to, to lead us to treatment for these patients because that's what matters. Pulmonary genetics is teaching us a great deal. There are many different uh, avenues in which advances are being made. The diagnosis of disease, patterns of disease in families, a uh, un better understanding of the natural history of diseases that relate to specific genetic disturbances. So the at-risk relative study was a natural pairing between members of our interstitial lung disease program and our interest in early detection for pulmonary fibrosis and the mission of the Pulmonary Genetics Center. And in this study, we brought back undiagnosed first-degree relatives of patients with pulmonary fibrosis. We put them through a battery of testing all with the purposes of screening for early stages of pulmonary fibrosis and assessing the role of genetics in detecting early stages of pulmonary fibrosis. What we wanted to do was bring genetic testing out of the research space and into the space where we're communicating those results with patients. When we're able to make a genetic diagnosis in these patients, we often can better understand the mechanism of why their lung disease is occurring. Across the country, there has been rapid uh, improvement in understanding of the child disorders, and uh, there's many new genes that have been discovered over time that help us to better understand lung development, surfactant metabolism, uh, lung injury and repair, and ho hopefully someday uh, understanding the genetics of these disorders will help us to uh, provide cures for these patients. The Pulmonary Genetics Center really represents in my mind the best of two great institutions, the Boston Children's Hospital and the Brigham and Women's Hospital, and being able to bring together 
the really unique resources to care for our patients is something that we're all proud of.